segment is your introduction to the Radiant Rain product made by Luminart Inc. Radiant Rain is a hybrid acrylic watercolor. Hybrid means it's a cross. It's got a little bit of watercolor and a little bit of acrylic, which means Radiant Rain is not limited to the traditional surfaces that an acrylic would go on. There are 36 gorgeous shimmering colors in the Radiant Rain Shimmering Mist. It comes with a bonus two ounce mister bottle that you can fill up with this easy to pour flip top that comes available on the four ounce bottle. Radiant Ray also has a pure color concentrate. Pure color concentrate is just like it sounds. It's got double the color of the shimmering mist. <clears throat> we have put this handy little dauber tool on the top. Great for applying directly to a rubber stamp or other projects. Heck, kids can even color up their notebooks with it. Also in the uh, Radiant Rain line is the extender. It is some of the base that the colors are put in. Just in case somebody, say, for by chance, fell in love with this color of blue but wanted a lighter shade, they could take an empty mister bottle, pour a little bit of this Radiant Rain Cobalt Blue off, add some extender, and they have just made a lighter value of that product. L lighter value means lighter or darker color. Now I want to talk about the care and feeding of the little tools. Uh, we have, we offer uh, the Mr. Tops for sale, we offer the Dauber Tops for sale. I want you to take very good care of them. When I am done with them, I personally will run the little stained sponge on the end of my Dauber cap under some warm water to release the acrylic that might have been caught up in here in the head when I'm using it. Same thing with the Mr. Top. The Mr. Top has a little spring that we want to keep cleaned off with warm water. As I said, Radiant Rain is a hybrid. That means we are not limited to paper. I've done some porcelain tile here just to give you an idea that it goes on other surfaces. Other, uh, <coughs> you can also make some absolutely gorgeous papers. Just drop them on sandwich paper and put two pieces together. Got a beautiful boutique and next thing you know I took fresh leaves from my garden and there you go. And there's more leaves from my garden, a different color combination, and more leaves from my garden. Feast your eyes on that. Thank you for joining me, and I hope you guys have a radiant day. And I'll see you in our very next segment, where we'll be discussing how to make this gorgeous paper. Bye-bye.